Lee Jones's life revolved around citrus. Um, I love ag. I mean, I love being outdoors. For 30 years, this Martin County man managed groves around the state. I really enjoy studying the soil. He'd been thinking about a new career path in recent years when COVID dealt him a blow. My largest client needed to sell out because he was heavily invested in the hospitality. And uh, when that happened, then, I mean, I lost, you know, 70% of my business overnight. His citrus business struggling after his main client pulled out. Jones one day was driving along Interstate 95 when he was struck with an idea. Look at the tradition, I was like, man, you know, I could be spraying, that used to be all the orange groves, I could be spraying it. I just kind of felt the Lord drop my spirit. Well, you can still spray it, you just gotta spray houses. So Jones started up a pest control business with his son. Learn to balance the business with the family, try to not intertwine them too, too much. <laughs> Peter Jones says the business is off to a promising start, partly because of their relationship. You know, I think that our morals are the main part of it, you know, we understand each other. And Lee Jones says a lot of his knowledge from the citrus grove applies here. With all the uh, algae blooms and everything happening, you really need science behind what you're doing. Jones says he's always had an entrepreneurial mind, so even at age 53, he was ready to take the leap. You got to study it, understand the business, understand the market, and uh, if you have an idea, then just uh, my, my, my take on it is, is, is go for it. <laughs> In Martin County, John Shaman, WPTV, News Channel 5.